me go for one day Let me lose myself again Give me something for the pain Always trying to pretend That I'm not living just a lie Broken heart and shattered lives Let me go for one day Let me lose myself Hello, is this Karen speaking? Ah, uh, Yolanda, is Karen there? Yolanda, yeah. What's your Yes, okay. So I bought curtains from Karen two years back. No, 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 I'm lying. Last year. And now I want to wash them with my washing machine. I'm not sure if I can just throw them in the washing machine. What's your name? Um, curtains. What's your material? It's, the material? it's like cotton, it's like woven cotton, it's like the hard one. Oh, and yes, it's got block outs. Yes, block outs. Yes, it's, it's, it's not allowed. Mm, not allowed. Oh, okay, so you don't yeah, know. Hair or, 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 washing or damper cloth? Damper cloth or bathroom? Damper cloth and okay, wash. Uh, which, which color are you are? Gray. Gray? Yes. Dark gray? No, no, no. Yeah, it's it's gray. like beige, grayish. I don't know this color. Oh, uh, okay, yeah. No, no, no. I'm going to get more. I'm going to watch a machine and much damage. Okay, that's fine. Gray. Thank you. Gray. Yeah, gray. Okay. okay, thank you. Bye. Thank you. Just get out of my sight Let me go for one day Let me lose myself Oh, I knew How this would end How oh, I knew That it would die That we would Come to this That we would Say goodbye time joining me then welcome welcome to my channel i am yolanda kumala also known as tushi on twitter instagram and on the street so this is my reset vlog i finally decided my year is starting on the first of february um i never really have like a certain time but one thing i know is that my year never starts on the first of january never my year always starts after I've done I've, or I've had this weekend to myself where I reset, I reset my space, I reset my mind, I reset my energy. Tomorrow I've got a spa day booked at Life Day Spa in VNA and for the past three years that's what I've been doing and those have been the best years of my life so we're doing it again this year again. So my appointment for tomorrow is like at quarter past quarter to 11 actually i need to double check because i don't want to be late i want to just not be late and arrive on time today is saturday and all i have planned for today was just to kind of clean like i like you guys saw in the vlog and i'm still going to clean i'm still going to continue I'm not done but i thought let me just come in and say hi 
and then continue because i haven't said hi um yeah i'm just going to like sort of pack all of the stuff that i don't feel comfortable letting my helper do and then everything else that i that she does i'll just leave it to her and she's coming in tomorrow at around nine o'clock so i'll just drop off the keys by her and then i will go to my spa day and i'll probably come back and my place will be sparkling clean this is me resetting for the year and i'm gonna take you guys through it this is literally something that i do all the time every year i do this like it's like routine it's like tradition this is how i thought of my year but i've just never recorded it in the previous years anyway Zolo. if you follow me on instagram you know that i tried out the store it is in clement i think or let's say yeah it's in, it's in clement um the store is called wild republic and they've got like very very nice stuff that you don't just find anywhere like refines and yes so i'm just going to do a little bit of unboxing for you guys i haven't done this unboxing on instagram and i don't think i will anyways the first thing we found there was these two cute wooden spoons all the way from thailand um it was sourced by her, a friend of hers etc like there's a story behind it and it's also got like the this like whole linda you bam man it's like crystal it's orange and obviously i love orange so this was like a perfect find and the nice thing about it is that, is that it was on sale and we paid like 149 for it so i really love like they even feel rich and really like on the hand um i was telling my boyfriend i was like i'm not gonna cook anything hectic like keep up and don't no these wooden spoons it's just gonna be like salads like light stuff because i really can't ruin them i think this is something i could never find even she had like about four or five and it was different colors but that color obviously won my heart and then this apron this apron was 450 so the thing is with me i love to be in the kitchen and obviously you guys know me like i like to have the whole look all sorted so even the kitchen i said the apron and the pecker and also because like you know you're just protecting him as well it's a very nice apron it's a, like very good quality it's got a leather up but she also said that it was made from cycling bicycles i think and yeah i love the color i fell in love with the color it was so stunning when i wore it i'm gonna try and put it on for you guys but the nice thing about it is that she gave it she gave it to me for free because i tagged her and i think she got following while i was still at the store i'm gonna try to put it on for you guys i really don't want to get off this step obviously of course okay maybe i should get off the step so of course it is big on me of course it's big of course but I will take it to my tailor lady at Cannon Walk and I'm going to ask her to make it fit now my size. I think I want it to be the length. It looks so stunning. Oh, and then also it's got like, you can also adjust it up so you can tie it at the very last one so that it fits you. Um, yeah, I just fell in love with it and she gave it to me for free. So it is definitely worth buying. The quality is amazing. Okay, I need to return and then another thing i got was this cup i got this coffee mug cup i was actually planning to get an espresso one but then i was like i couldn't need since Ndila Pawit, let me get this one how much was it going for it was going for 120 the espresso one is like 379 i was like honestly uh, i couldn't need you guys know that my brother bought me a coffee machine so i thought getting a travel coffee mug will be best in order for me to be able to save money and stop going to seattle so seattle coffee will finally for real for real for real never ever see me again like i said in my previous video they will have to draw me okay because now i have a travel and then it also comes with like complimentary sweets that they gave to me and my partner and then um just the card it's a very professional store in layers and it's very small you guys should go check it out their stuff are like rare finds but definitely affordable i would say because i mean this apron is 450 it was not on sale i feel like that's like an affordable standard price because i'm pretty sure those are like the prices where it depends, like range between even in actual stores without boring you guys with all of the chit chat i think i'm gonna just go back to the cleaning i'm going to my bedroom now to do my wardrobe it's such a mess yo sana it's a mess it frustrates me like when you open a wardrobe and it's heavy on you you're just like this is not the way my life has just been omgekrap and i think it's time to fix it
much 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 later. Guys, we are currently in my bathroom now. And what's going to happen is we are going to declutter this cupboard. There's so many things here that I don't use because I think I've finally found the products I use for my face so I can literally throw away everything else. I don't like to give away skincare products because people might have reactions and whatnot. This brand I tried out two years back. It's called Nutri Herbs. Um, I think their vitamin C, vitamin C usually helps with like clearing dark spots and rejuvenate your skin. So they sent it to me as a collab and at that time I was like desperate trying to figure out what is it that I can use for my skin. Sorry, I'm doing my, I'm washing my dishes with the dishwasher. So it's making a noise. Here I've got like the spot clear acid patch. This I can definitely keep. I once tried out this product. Um, it's called Neutrogena. My brother was using Nutrition at that time and I think it was doing like him good. So when I tried it out, I literally burned. Like each time I wash my face, I would feel it burning. So I used it like a couple of times near Bona. This is like the toner and the face wash. This was probably like a couple of washes and I was like, ah, this thing is not the one. I can't keep burning each time I use it. I've got more samples here. Mm. The Porsche M, I've also once used this product like religiously. It really did make a difference, I'm not going to lie. But it was more of like a maintenance thing and not like treatment. So whenever I stopped using Porsche M, all of my pimples would come back. So I was like, okay, we're not doing that. Um, this was one of the collabs I had on YouTube. Um, use it to remove your makeup. So we're going to keep that. And then I've got scrubs for days, Porsche M, Body Shop. Basically, there's quite a lot of stuff to just get rid of here. So I'm just going to do that really and throw stuff that I don't need away. They can steam iron for me because obviously I have other things to do after my spa date and I can't be walking around like this. Like maybe I think at Life Day Spa they should also have like an iron because they have like quite a lot of stuff like hair dryers, um, toiletries just in case you forgot your toiletries. Oh yes, another thing guys, I forgot my um, bikini so I have to, I definitely have to start at the mall. To get a bikini at Mr. Price, or uh, I don't think I can afford Woolies, ne? Um, I think I'll check Mr. Price, and then if Mr. Price doesn't have, I'll go to H and M definitely. I'm gonna see you guys at the mall. I just arrived at Claremont now, and I popped. Yo, you know when I wake up, I always feel like my lips look so thick. Like I feel like even now, like talking is like problem like they look so perky and thick just want to ask if they have like a card machine hello buddy hello. do you guys have a card machine no? you're okay so i'll throw up about timbers thank you good that i asked because i don't have cash and i don't have snap scan um i'm gonna go now to mr price and find out if they can assist me 
with my two issues. Let's go. Here we go, I put this miserable song on repeat. Cause you seem to forget how much you are hurting me. Do what's right, you say you will, but then you don't. You just don't. You don't care, cause you don't take me seriously. What's there to repair if you don't want to? You knew me so much better You're on a lifetime sentence So now you never feel my presence So you thought I would let this slip Thought you knew me so much better person I was sitting in there in the um, steam room so I'm just putting on my tripod I was sitting in the steam room there and I was just like in my thoughts and yeah I feel like the sauna and the steam room it's like one place that honestly always teaches me that mind over matter you know because you know how it always steams up and it gets so hot inside there and obviously if you want to finish your session which for me like i don't see the point of me going inside the steam room only to come out five minutes later you know like i just want to make use of it so that it actually does its job um so you you have to zeng it like you have to talk to your brain and be like we can do it and the minute you start doing that like you really feel your body relaxing you become and you start getting used to the heat and then after another five minutes you just you you even forgot about you're actually in a steam room mind over matter anyways i'm currently at vnway mall parking lot and i just want to go inside and do uh shopping yana for myself or at home um i want to also um i want to also then go home to my place drop off my stuff so i really want to do everything in the next like two to three hours so i probably won't even eat because eating will waste my time um i'll probably grab something like that i can munch on on the way but yeah i want to go to woolies do my groceries and checkers do my groceries and typo i want to go to typo as well and get a new um diary for 2024 and yeah we're back on the road back 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 on the road um this is basically how i always start my years every single year but i think i've just never documented it i always just talk about it but literally like everything i'm doing i do it every single year just like this like there's nothing that's different that i'm doing um i usually clean uh, i go to the spa buy a new journal grocery shopping um yeah so standard standard procedure it's been working no need to change something that's not broken i'm gonna see you guys inside let this slip Thought you knew me so much better You're on a lifetime sentence So now you never feel my presence So you thought I would let this slip Thought you knew me so much better
guys i actually just arrived home now i just want to put you guys right here because you know whenever i have new groceries i put you right here so that if there's something interesting i want to show you i can just turn and be like nance i got this <laughs> so let me just get you guys on the tripod I decided to actually put you guys here because um, the lighting that side is not so great because of this light that's on and I need this light on. Um, I, bought, I bought quite a lot of stuff. I spent quite a lot today, a lot of money actually today. But you know what? Like I feel so good. I feel so happy. I feel like it's fine. It might have this weird scenes, but this feeling, this feeling right now, come on. So obviously the kitchen stuff, you know, you, you guys know that we don't do any unboxings in this house. Is there anything interesting that I would like to show you guys that's new? Oh, I just added the uh, chili flakes. Um, spice from Woolies because I usually see people added cream, avocado and stuff like that. So I just want to taste my taste on Johnny. Always looks good though. Always looks like aesthetic and pleasing. I want whichever one do with it. Um, but like I just, I'm more interested in the taste really. Um... Yeah, guys, I just got like is in this essential, but then my groceries were just is in this fridge, like nyama and all of that stuff. Things like vegetables, I will definitely buy as I cook, so like I'll buy week to week. So maybe tomorrow after work, I have to stop at um, Woolies or Checkers and then get a few stuff that I want. I got some pineapple. I was watching another TikTok, and some lady was talking about how pineapple is very good for your vagina. I did try to google it but google didn't really give me like a definite answer to say i understand but how is it good what does it really do i've been seeing this joke going around people like eating um pineapple when they're going to their boyfriends like i really would like you guys to let me in on it in the comment section because i'm really interested to know about what is up with e pineapple what does it do you know i'm i'm not sure whether it's for yeah just like what does it do help me there but i got it anyways because i'm a woman and so because i read the comment section and everyone was just going crazy about it by you and i was like hey eh, i can't be missing out on this now to unbox some more interesting stuff um so let's start with the small one i went to typo today and i went to buy a journal obviously you guys know it so when i start a year i need a new journal baby um, and you guys know I love the um, journals from Typo. And I also like the fact that I can put my name on it. This year, in 2024, I don't know. I just chose to go with Yolanda. As you can see, it's written Yolanda in silver. And yeah, it's the normal journal that you guys know. But I also added an accessory, which is like a pen pouch. Uh, I thought it was cute. So this is how you put it. This is my journal, right? So I need to... We forgot. Basically, it's it's kind of just like this thing here, you know. We are in really sagans. I think this is really cute, even though it does cover my name a little bit. There we go, and then I can get like a nice pen and put it in here. I checked e pens, Papa Typo, and I must say, Typo is very expensive. You e pay a hundred rand. Like, what am I writing? what am i writing exactly yep in a hundred rand i was like yes it's aesthetically pleasing but financially it's not making sense and right now at that time mindy they said he's taking his girls girl's boy yeah so i was just like i'm spending a lot of money so let me tell you about how i ended up with girl's boy girl ex boy i've always said girl's boy girl ex boy um so what happened is that i wanted to charge my phone that's the initial thing because now but the only thing i had to do at kennel at waterfront was to go do my grocery shopping go to type one and go home but my phone died and i was like i actually need my phone to drive home and to enter the gates at home i need my phone on so i was like okay let me go to i store i went to i store i got it i store they said about what's the charge said they don't have the fast chargers i have to charge on those display stuff and those stuff they take forever because if phones I was tell us and was like I would have to leave the phone and go and that guy was like you can't leave your phone here because I'm not gonna watch it so you can charge but it's at your own risk and I was like okay you know what this is wasting my time because I can't be standing in one position and if only you are like one percent two percent I'm like no this is a joke I then went to Galax but my mind was like let's just go to Gal oh I went to MTN MTN they were like no about charges I was like okay cool fine you know what 
let me go to garlic spoil my thinking was that garlic spoil i'm pretty sure the people that work there they're more nicer you know like and when no was on nigga phone yeah but i don't know i think it's just the how the brand was introduced to us on um the when they had an opening it's giving chilled vibes it gives like a family brand type of thing like where you can walk in and say guys really charge a dog and not charge a water tot and you know they're just gonna give it to you they basically our people hi nyani i went to garlic spoil i get there when i get there uh, I'm like guys my phone is low or whatever and they actually give me a phone like um, a charger this guy's like no fine I'll charge it so obviously when charge I'm like oh okay do you guys have that shoe that I've always wanted he shows me I see the sandal that I bought um he shows me that and then I wear it yo I fell in love with the sandal instantly so much that i looked at the other shoe and i was like between the two shoes obviously i managed to buy both guys i was like between the two shoes if i'm choosing any it's definitely this one guess which one it is just take a guess i was actually very surprised that they actually had my size and even all two they have i think they also have one i was like oh very nice you know very like i like a brand where everyone needs to actually have a size so this is my shoe that i got i chose the sandal i would i don't want to lie i was very impressed with the quality my babe i don't think anyone has ever spoken about how proper it looks i thought it was like we want a sandal like if we flop like if flop flop i didn't know it was this hard up huh? i think i was very impressed with the quality of the brand i don't want to lie um i'm not sure if it's going to be comfortable it looks like it's uncomfortable but these are the shoes that you wear when you're going out two to three hours a day and then you take them off it's giving these are steve madden vibes i mean you guys know me i buy some to us uncomfortable and now one thing i'll do is wear it so i have that um there's another small package which i forgot in the car that i'll unbox for you guys maybe in my next vlog because i am closing off this vlog right now so yes guys that is my reset that's how i reset for a new year i just feel like a brand new person my pay lace is clean decluttered my wardrobes and i threw away things i don't need i'm starting afresh it's a clean slate the year has begun another thing is for me like i'm one person that believes in if something works the first time i can't not do it because i don't want to be in a situation niti what if it didn't what if this year doesn't go well and it's because kangenenzi routine yam so this is one routine that i'm not and compromising i like I, I i don't i don't compromise i always just plan accordingly because obviously it does need imali obviously so i just always have to plan accordingly and plan for it and then um do it i always do it in the beginning month of the year which is in january it could be mid january i think this year i did it a little bit later anyways guys this is the end of the video and i am going to see you guys on my next one and i just want to say happy new year <laughs> happy new year guys let's make it a blast i am handing over this year to god i'm just gonna wake up and do my part no stressing no data selling no overthinking handing it all over to god but i think i have been doing that so well because a lot of things from last year i literally just gave them to god like even things that i have nothing like absolutely no like idea about how are these things going to be sorted out i don't wake up and think about those things i am living my life as best way as i can and I am truly, truly in my happy girl era.